lens completely filled with water. Can't get it to turn on or off. All right, guys, good morning, everybody. It is the last day of school for my boys here. Rock Guy and crew going in for the last day of school. Official kickoff to summer, and I get the rare treat of taking them to school today. But guys, yes. that's only the first treat of many today because today we are going to Cowabunga Bay, baby. We're gonna hit up our favorite water park. Look at crew, he's stoked. And not only that, I promised these kids, you guys know that I have a bad habit of going to the gas station to get these kids treats way too often. And mom said, hey, you gotta chill on that. But I said, okay, then the next time we get a treat at the gas station on the way home from school is going to be your last day of school so guess what you guys that's today and mom took it up a notch we're getting snow shack snow cones is this the kickoff to summer or what yeah <laughs> this is going to be the craziest sickest most epic day now mom being the amazing amazing woman that she is is actually working this morning she's trying to pick up a few extra nail clients given our new business and our new path in life so she's inside working right now i'm going to take these kids to school then we're going to go pick them up we're going to hit up the water park get some snow cones this is freaking summer baby i was in there working now dad's taking a turn working he's getting the vlog up for you guys so we are are headed to where are we going hazy we're gonna go get the boys last day of school we're so excited to have summer start lots of cool fun things coming this summer i just want to be able to make sure that we're having tons of fun this summer so dad and i've talked about a lot of fun things we're gonna do stay tuned and get excited because it's gonna be an awesome adventure here are my studs last day of school so excited hi, hi. last day of school you guys, how was your last day? Good. The end of it was not good because you know those rods in the middle of the two doors? Uh-oh, did you run into one? <laughs> Were you looking at a cute girl? No, I was talking to my friend. Oh my gosh, Riley, that's so sad. I'm sorry. So we are a little preemptive in our celebration of summer because none of the snow cone places are open yet. Mom says they open at like 3 o'clock. Maybe during the summer they'll be open during the day a little School's earlier. We're technically still in session. Our kids are the first ones to get out of school. So but as a backup plan, we're going to go get some slushies at the gas station. You know we're good at treats at the gas station. <laughs> we know how to gas station. As luck would have it, this guy's favorite flavor of snow cone happens to be pina colada. We just walked in to discover pina colada extreme frozen drink. <laughs> Okay, Hazy just wants whatever she can reach up there. So they do have red cherry, pina colada, blue raspberry, and then of course, Dad's Mountain Dew. Sorry guys, can't have it. <laughs> Kirby Doo, what did you get for your flavors, my man? Uh, I got all the kid flavors, so red cherry, pina colada, and blue raspberry. Oh, dang. A triple stacker and ragai, full pina, baby. <laughs> We're going patriotic over here, red, white, and blue. You guys, summer's underway. First slushies of the summer. Not technically a snow cone, so stand by for our first snow cone run. We'll have to do that one a little bit later. Do that tomorrow. All right, guys, we're gonna pound these summer slushies and then it's off to where, everybody? <laughs> you guys totally match the Cowabunga Bay car. You guys, check it out. The check-in process, getting all of our passes took, what, almost an hour? Almost an hour. Yeah, almost an hour, but we're in, and here's the beautiful part about opening day season pass holders. Season pass holders. It's like empty. There's nobody here. Normally this place is so jam-packed, and it is empty. You have your choice of seats. You got your choice of slides. You got your spot. Well, Lazy River is actually getting pretty popular pretty quick. That's these guys' favorite thing. Hazy's in this thing you're not supposed to be in. That's summer. The sound of that bucket is the sound of summer. We're gonna be here all summer long. Hazy girl, are you ready? <laughs> we just cashed in those season passes that Mon and Papa gave us for Christmas. If you haven't checked that out, go back and watch the Christmas vlog. The kids were ecstatic when they got them. They got Cowabunga Bay shirts, Cowabunga Bay mugs, and season passes. We're going to be spending so much time here this summer. It's one of our favorite places. We just usually only come once or twice a summer. That's all we were able to really fit in. But now we're going to have tons of time and availability. And we've got the passes, so there's no excuse not to come all the time. So enjoy Cowabunga Bay. not familiar with Cowabunga Bay. It's a gigantic single apparatus water park. So it's like one structure. Everything's tied together with walkways, shooting water guns, dumping water buckets, and there's slides off of everything. So it's just a giant maze of really just summer fun. So you can see why it's one of our favorite places. It's very colorful, very kid friendly. Parents can sit at the bottom. You just wait for your kids to come down. Or if you're like me and you're just a big kid, you can come join them. I'm gonna send it. <laughs> Whoa. Let's go, Kirby. Three, two, one. Get to the bucket! 
So this bucket dumps, I don't know, like every couple minutes, but it rings a bell at the top when it's about ready to dump, and you just see kids running to get inside of it. Okay, not just kids, you also see me running. I wanna go on every single one, dude. Literally, there's almost no lines. I wanna hit every single one. water park and doesn't want her hair wet guys. So that's another fun part about this you guys is the buckets and the hoses are all over the place and you can use them to dump on you as you walk underneath. Let's see we're trying to find the green slide. It is so much fun getting lost in here but it's dangerous if you don't want a bucket dumped on you. These things like this right here. Someone's going down this slide but you can dump it right on them. That's just part of the fun here at Calabunga Bay. What does this do? Oh! <laughs> that's what that does, bro. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh, there goes the ding, ding, ding. Here it goes. <laughs> Guys, it's summer. It is officially summer. Lazy River next. Nothing that I love more than water parks in summer. No joke, almost nothing I love more. And this is one of our favorites by far. We're gonna be here a lot and we're gonna check out the one in Las Vegas, Bill's fan band. Keep an eye out, we're coming down for you. <laughs> Almost as fun as the water park is, of course, the food, the concessions. They have a lot of great lunch and dinner options here. The pizzas, corn dogs, and sodas going down here at Calabunga Bay today, you guys. This is the greatest kickoff to summer. Whoa, Brexy Doodle down in two pieces of pizza. Kirby Doo, how's your pizza going? One down, one tiny sliver to go. Mom went corn dog. Casey's got a fistful of pizza. Right guys got the corn dog and fries. Guys, this is how you bing them on the last day of school, first day of summer vacation. Sunny, sunny summer day, but we learned a valuable lesson today in which cameras you should and should not bring to a water park. You should bring a GoPro. It's yes, waterproof. Always, always. It's rugged. It's great for water slides. It's great for underwater action. You should not bring your Canon G7X vlogging camera that you love as much as you love anything in your family because we had a little bit of an incident. One of the kids came back to get goggles out of the swim bag. We had two gigantic, freshly filled jugs of water. water. Pulled the goggles up, tipped the jug upside down, went to go play. We came back to our pool bag that deep in water, phone soaked, camera literally floating in water. Yeah. You probably can't see it in here, but lens completely filled with water. Can't get it to turn on or off. Grateful that my, my phone was also in there, face down. Thankfully, phone my to be phone's okay. working. So. Vlogging camera dead. So you guys, we might be on the GoPro for a minute while we figure out what to do, if we can get this one repaired, or if we need to run to Best Buy and grab a new one. But we'll be back to our vlogging hotness very soon. Until then, enjoy the GoPro footage here at Calabunga Bay. Thanks, guys. And lesson learned, we won't be bringing this camera to any more water parks. It's my fault. It's actually mine. It's a combination of faults. <laughs> On this one, guys, it actually says the world's biggest splash might be the biggest bucket drop at a water park. Have to confirm that, but the bell is ringing. Kids are coming. Let's get in this thing.
family. That was, awesome. that was so cool. <laughs> Wrapping up our first day of the official kickoff to summer here at Cowabunga Bay, getting dried off. We're gonna head home, get kids into bed. I think we've worn ourselves down, but like mom said, first thing we're doing? New camera. Buying a new camera on the way home. This one, toast. Toast, toast. <laughs> yeah! No, no, yeah. Guys, if it's any question as to the dedication that we have to this vlog, we've already got a new vlogging camera in my hands right now. Ah! <laughs> Stopped at Best Buy on the way back, picked it up, because we cannot sacrifice quality with you guys. We gotta give you the best stuff no. all the time, because this is how we bring them, and this is our life. It's the vlog life. Damaged the camera today, totally ruined. You guys, it's toast. Like, it won't like open, close the lens. Like, you can see water inside the lens. You can see water inside. You can't even get the screen on. It is fried. We looked up stuff on it. It basically says if it's water damage, just chalk it's it up as an expensive cost. lesson. <laughs> expensive lesson. Don't get those wet. <laughs> Only take the GoPros to the water park. We yeah. got a new camera. Tomorrow, we have two soccer games. Crew and Brexton are doing their last soccer games. Oh, last the, soccer games of the For the season? spring season, yes. Okay. You guys, it's Memorial Day weekend. We have a lot of stuff in store for you guys, so it's hang be tight. Awesome. Make sure to check out our Instagram, at This Is How We Bingham. That's usually where I'll post like stuff that's going on real time, so check it out so you can be oh, like- Oh, and I did a sick boomerang underneath a giant dumping bucket of water today, so check that out. Oh yeah, you did it on your phone. That was on my phone. Underneath the bucket of water. My phone was under the water too. Guys, the things survived. we do to bring you the savagery. Uh, savagery. Also, guys, lots of new faces around here. We love that every Thank single day. You. We find hundreds and hundreds of new faces, so it is great to see you. Thank you guys for Welcome signing up, subscribing. Welcome to the Bingham family. A little bit We're crazy, a little bit of awesome. What is that up there? Our family is just the right mix of chaos and love. I turn it and show it to you, but it's covered by balloons and other things like that. Anyways, but that is us. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. The very first day kickoff to summer. It's about to get crazy. It's we going love to be you an amazing so much. summer. Thanks, guys. See ya. See ya. Three, two, one, send it. Woo!